Yeah, everybody will eventually want to spray. Jordan, you're in the overspray area. <laughs> Disclaimer number one. This is not a paint class. Okay. Uh, you're not going to learn how to paint in the next 30 minutes. Disclaimer number two. I'm not a painter. I have, I have painted airplanes. I've, I've done three or four of them before. I, I do all the tub chip work, but I do not consider myself a painter. Same thing with welding. You guys have seen what a good welder is somebody that welds every other day, and, and they just have that touch. Painters are the same way. They, they naturally have the ability to work the gun and, and understand how paint flows and whatnot. I don't have either of those qualities. I can't weld and I can't paint consistently well. I'm going to show you everything I know, but what it's going to come down to is you pulling the trigger and you practicing. And so, when you're at this point in your project, do you want to roll it into the paint booth and start spraying paint? No. Better clean it off. No, no. You need to practice. Okay. Get you an old panel. Find an old wing. Get an old door. Um, if you, once you get used to spraying and, and how to move and pull the trigger and, and how to set up the dials and get the right amount of flow and the right amount of air and whatnot. The right amount of light. The right amount of light. Oh, light is critical. Practice, 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 yeah, practice. And then roll your project right into, the, yeah. into the panel. Yeah. Because here's the truth. You've spent two years, two months, yeah, a lot of time.